In 2013, archaeologists began a three-year project of recording Wrestle Castle and its surrounding area. A grant from the Castle Studies Trust in 2014 allowed the gardens to be examined in detail. This video gives a short tour of the landscape around the castle and shows what we found. Wrestle Castle was built by Thomas Percy in the 1390s. By the late 14th century, the Percy family was one of the most powerful dynasties in northern England. Amongst their extensive properties were the castles of Walkworth, Annick, Prudhoe, Langley, Cockermouth, Egremont, and Wrestle. In the last quarter of the 14th century, the Percys carried out building work at three castles, Cockermouth, Walkworth, and of course Wrestle. The modern manor of Wrestle is outlined in yellow, and gives a rough idea of how far it might have extended in the medieval period. The medieval village extended further west, but has been replaced in part by the castle, which sits at one end of the modern settlement. To the west is the River Derwent, while deer parks lay north of the village, and between Wrestle and the nearby settlement of Newsholm. The area surveyed by Ed Denison Archaeological Services is shown in red. The castle used to be quadrangular, similar in layout to Bolton Castle, also in Yorkshire. Today, only the south range of Wrestle Castle survives. The remainder of the castle was demolished by Parliament in around 1650. It was surrounded by a moat, with a garden between the moat and the castle. Called the Moat Garden, this is shown in green. The gardens were founded around the same time as a castle, and continued to be developed into the late 15th century. The survey carried out shows that the village used to extend further to the west, but was replaced by the gardens. The old gardens are highlighted in green. Earthworks show where part of the village once stood. Further south is an area which could have been a village green, but ponds were added at a later date. To the west is an area of marshy meadow, which may once have been used as a dock for transport along the River Derwent. The landscape is completed with the rest of the moat and a later garden to the north. For the full report from Wrestle Castle, including how the gardens were experienced from the castle itself, visit our website. There's a link in the description.